How to get started with Azure Virtual Desktop Pricing Here are When choosing an Azure WVD pricing, asterisk number of users. The number of users you need to support will affect the cost of your Azure WVD deployment. You can choose to pay per user per month, PUVM, or per session per month, PSM. Asterisk Virtual Machine Size The virtual machine size you choose will affect the cost of your Azure WVD deployment. You can choose from a variety of virtual machine sizes, each with its own price point. Asterisk Features the features you need will affect the cost of your Azure WVD deployment. For example, if you need to support remote desktop access, you will need to choose a pricing plan that includes that feature. Asterisk storage. The amount of storage you need will affect the cost of your Azure WVD deployment. You can choose from a variety of storage options, each with its own price point. Asterisk bandwidth. The amount of bandwidth you need will affect the cost of your Azure WVD deployment. You can choose from a variety of bandwidth options, each with its own price point. Asterisk location. The location of your Azure WVD deployment will affect the cost of your deployment. For example, deployments in North America tend to be more expensive than deployments in other regions. Once you have considered these factors, you can choose the pricing plan that best meets your needs. Part 2, Perform Azure WVD Cost Optimization Here are some tips on how to perform Azure WVD Cost Optimization, asterisk choose the right pricing plan. There are a variety of pricing plans available for Azure WVD, so you can choose the one that best meets your needs. For example, if you have a small number of users, you may be able to save money by using the pay-as-you-go pricing plan. Asterisk optimize your virtual machine sizes. The virtual machine size you choose will affect the cost of your Azure WVD deployment. You can choose from a variety of virtual machine sizes, each with its own price point. Choose a virtual machine size that is the right size for your needs. Asterisk use Azure Reserve Virtual Machine Instances. Azure Reserve Virtual Machine Instances can help you save money on your Azure WVD deployment. You can purchase a reserved virtual machine instance for a one-year or three-year term. This will lock in the price of the virtual machine instance for the term of the reservation. Asterisk use Azure Spot Virtual Machines. Azure Spot Virtual Machines can help you save money on your Azure WVD deployment. Spot Virtual Machines are available at a discounted price, but they may be terminated if Azure needs the capacity for other VMS. If you are willing to accept the risk of your VMS being terminated, you can save money by using Spot Virtual Machines. Asterisk use Azure Auto Scale. Azure Auto Scale can help you save money on your Azure WVD deployment. AutoScale can automatically increase or decrease the number of virtual machines in your Azure WVD deployment based on demand. This can help you save money by only paying for the virtual machines that you are using. Asterisk use Azure Hybrid Benefit. Azure Hybrid Benefit can help you save money on your Azure WVD deployment. If you have on-premises Windows Server licenses, you can use Azure Hybrid Benefit to reduce the cost of your Azure WVD virtual machines. Asterisk use Azure Cost Management. Azure Cost Management can help you track your Azure WVD costs and identify areas where you can save money. Cost management can also help you set budgets and alerts for your Azure WVD costs. By following these tips, you can optimize your Azure WVD costs and save money on your deployment. Part 3, Competitors to Azure Virtual Desktop. Here are some of the competitors to Azure Virtual Desktop, asterisk Amazon Workspaces, asterisk Citrix Virtual Apps and Desktops, asterisk VMware Horizon, asterisk Google Workspace. These competitors offer a variety of features and benefits, such as, asterisk cost savings, asterisk scalability, asterisk reliability, asterisk security, asterisk ease of use. When choosing a competitor to Azure Virtual Desktop, you should consider your specific needs and requirements. 